In this video we share Medjugorje visionary Mariana on the 10 secrets and the triumph. Medjugorje seer Mariana revealed that the discovery of 10 secrets is not far away, but she could not add anything more. When secrets are a thing of the past, the world will be a different but better place in every way. Secrets mark the beginning of a new era one day the 10 secrets will be a thing of the past. Then the world will be completely different, for the better. This is because, Miriana explains, secrets are a signal of transition from one age to another. But what will this new age be like? The seer reassures the believers about this and explains, this new age will be an age of peace, so it will be much more understandable why the Virgin Mary herself called herself the Queen of Peace when she first appeared in Medjugorje. In that new time after the secrets, humanity will live peacefully, far from the conflicts between people and the conflicts with God that are experienced these days. The reason why they need to keep secrets and not reveal to the world what awaits them is related to their nature. These are works of purification, which according to Miriana are necessary, but in their current state of sin, humanity is not ready for it. And therefore the ultimate goal of the entire series of mysteries is to cleanse, purify and humble men, restoring humanity to its purpose and restoring the true proportions of the relationship between God and man. So is there anything to be afraid of secrets? It seems clear that for those who live the message, it will be a painless passage that brings exceptional joy, the seers say that life in the world will change with the knowledge of the secrets entrusted to them by Our Lady. Afterwards, people will believe as in ancient times, said the Franciscan friars in 1983, who were spiritual advisors to the visionaries. For this reason, seers continue to call people to conversion day by day, in order to fully lift the message. That is why Our Lady continues to send her messages, hoping that sooner or later the majority of humanity will believe again, I have an optimistic vision of the future. If we all start living these messages, from the Virgin Mary, a new world will be born, said visionary Maria Pavlovich in 1988. And so the secrets also mean the end of the current iron fist of Satan over humanity, in the second year of the apparitions to the seer Miriana it was said, this century in which you live is under the rule of Satan, but when the secrets entrusted to you are revealed, his power will be destroyed, April 14, 1982. The triumph of the Immaculate Heart of Mary will open an era of peace. It will not come from politicians, but from humanity that has reconciled itself to God, visionary Mariana once said, don't be afraid to have children. Since the seers knew the secrets, many people wondered if they had gotten married and had children. However, they could not predict anything and doubt lasted for a long time. It was a great relief when Ivanka, the first to see the Virgin Mary, was the first to have a child. Today, all the visionaries have children, 17 of them in total. After all, having children is one of the most important parts of earthly life. Miriana also said it clearly when she scolded those who were afraid to have children. The seer also called God's people to have children during an interview given to Sister Emmanuel in 1989. Sister Emmanuel, yesterday you conveyed very strong affirmations of Our Lady. For example, don't be afraid to have children. You should rather fear that you don't have them. The more children you have, the better. Miriana, yes, I said it and I know why I said it, but I can't tell you more. Sister Emmanuel, oh, and you know that. Miriana, nods her head, smiling, with the assurance of a strong confession of faith. When the secrets are revealed, people will understand why it was so important for them to have many children. We are all waiting for the triumph of the Immaculate Heart of Mary. Thank you for supporting my channel. May God bless you and keep you. Our Lady, Queen of Peace, pray for us.